Hello, and welcome to the Easy Raider Academy. In the next few videos, we're going to learn everything there is to know about the Easy Raider. In this video, we're going to talk about the basics of driving the Easy Raider. Using Easy Raider is easy and intuitive, but it's very important to follow the safety rules during your entire ride. Always start your ride by putting on your helmet. Get on the board, spread your feet to shoulder width, bend your knees slightly, and place both hands on the handlebars. After making sure that the handbrakes are, in fact, released and in order, put the key in the switch and turn the vehicle on. Make sure the screen turns on. The screen shows the vehicle's work hours, the battery, and the voltage. You ready to go? Face forward and let's raid! Make sure to press the throttle gently. Electrical vehicles have a very high level of power availability. To stop, release the throttle and the vehicle will automatically brake to a full stop. Approaching an obstacle, you can press both brake handles to come to a full stop. Make sure to never take your foot off the Easy Raider while driving or getting off before the Easy Raider has come to a full stop. When driving backwards, press the red button on the left, look back, and gently press the throttle. To stop driving in reverse, release both throttle and reverse switch simultaneously. When driving, the vehicle can be steered by moving the handlebars or leaning your body in a surfing motion. Combining movement of your center of gravity helps the vehicle surf over the ground. If the vehicle is on, any slight touch to the throttle will make it move. Stay safe and turn the vehicle off whenever you dismount. If you've stopped on a slope, make sure to lock the brake handle on both sides with the catch. At nighttime, turn on the lights. Note that when the vehicle is on, it's quiet and no one will know you're behind them. Don't surprise anyone. The Easy Raider is not completely water resistant, so avoid deep water passages or entering water reservoirs. That's it. Have a pleasant and safe trip. Ready to take it up a notch? Cabo Electric Scooters is breathing new life to its series of scooters with the all-new GT Wolf King. A powerful high-speed electric scooter with stronger power compared to many competitors on the market to amplify the fun on your on- and off-road adventures. Not only are the essential components doubled, but so are its advantages and safety features. GT Wolf King features double motors of 2,000 watts, which maxes out at 8,400 watts and can travel over 62 miles per hour. With a boosted constant acceleration of up to 37 miles per hour within four seconds. The double frame design made of 6,082 aviation grade aluminum, along with the deck resting 217 millimeters off the ground, makes the scooter more durable and doubles the cushioning against heavy impact. The aesthetic design of double stems in the front provides upgraded maneuvering and stability for the rider. The dual suspension system is equipped with the same front hydraulic suspension found in high-end Harley motorcycles and rear double spring suspension to soak up every bump. Hi, I'm Joe with GoTrax and today we're going to be talking about the XR Ultra electric scooter. The XR Ultra is an entry-level scooter and a really good starting point for anyone looking to get into the electric scooter world. Featuring the classic GoTrax body style, lightweight and 8-inch shock absorbing tires makes it great for short commutes. The folding frame is perfect for storing it in an office, in a classroom, under a desk, but what really separates the XR Ultra from our other entry-level scooters is the battery and motor. The XR Ultra uses LG battery cells, the most reliable battery cells in the industry, and a 300 watt motor with peak wattage of 600 watt, making it 20% stronger than the Apex and GXL V2 models. Great for minor hills and quick bursts of speed. The LG battery cells are rated for up to a thousand cycles, making it great for daily use, but like all electric scooters expect to replace the brake pads every 500 to 1,000 miles, depending on the usage. Brake pads cost only a few dollars and can be found on the GoTrax.com parts section. 
The XR Ultra saves on battery life by requiring you to do a kick to start. Once you reach 1.8 miles per hour, you can then use the throttle. This little kick start improves the battery life by up to 40%. Additionally, there is a cruise control feature. If you hold the throttle down to max speed for 10 seconds, the cruise control engages for a more comfortable ride. You can disengage the cruise control by hitting either the throttle or the brake. The last feature to point out before we start riding is the 8.5 inch tires. The 8.5 inch rubber tires act as a shock absorber. If you run into a flat tire, most likely it is the inner tube that has popped and the tire is probably fine. This model uses two inch by 8.5 inch inner tubes. The ones from the factory are pre-slimed to make them last longer. But if you do have to replace it, we have replacement tubes on GoTracks.com or you can use any generic two inch by 8.5 inch inner tube. Just make sure to choose the one with a long enough air valve to make it easy to pump up. I'm Michael from Unagi and we make the world's best portable electric scooter. But don't take my word for it. With the Unagi, you get dual motor, front and rear. 250 watt in each for a total power output of 500 watts and a peak of 1,000 watts. You can travel up to 15 miles with a top speed of 15 miles per hour, all in a scooter that weighs less than 26 pounds. Now let me show you some of the key features of the Unagi Model 1. Starting with the tires. These are maintenance free, they have air cutouts for suspension, puncture proof so you never get a flat. Next we have the stem, this tube here. This is made of Japanese Torre carbon fiber. And as you come up here, it connects to the handlebar. It is constructed of magnesium, which makes our handlebar lighter by 33%. On to probably the most unique feature on the Unaki Model 1, and that's our one-click folding. Simple. One-click folding is so important as you're moving around a city. Whether you're coming up to your apartment and you need to climb some stairs, you're getting off the subway, you want to be able to do quickly, and with ease. Another unique feature on the Unagi Model 1 is the handlebar design with the integrated display. We have the throttle on this side and the brake on this side. And coming back to the power button, if we double tap it, it's going to toggle between dual motor and single motor mode. So on the fly, you can switch from running both motors to just one motor. And then finally, if we just tap the power button once to turn on the integrated headlight.